Thanks for the cheese experience. You're really welcome. <laughs> Is this my new favorite city? Hello guys and welcome back to a new episode here from Clan Amado. If you don't know us, we currently travel around New Zealand for 10 months and we are now in Nelson guys. We made it all the way up to the top of the South Island. So it's actually one of the oldest towns here in these South Islands. It's is a it, thriving, is thriving it city. The oldest town or one of the oldest? No, it is the oldest wow. town in the South Islands. And we're gonna give you our first impression today. Yeah. We're gonna explore and fully try to embrace Nelson <laughs> as much as possible today. Guys, and I haven't done much research yet, so it's really raw. But like we came in yesterday night and like honestly, like it's giving me such tropical vibe. I keep saying tropical. Felt like I was but driving like, into California yeah. or something. Like all the palm trees, everything. So we have beautiful weather and it was absolutely beautiful last night, the sunset. So and I can't wait to explore the city center of Nelson. Let's make it happen. And guys, Walk. today is Saturday, so there is a Nelson Saturday market on here. Apparently they have a lot of artsy kind of stalls and they also started to have a lot of food stalls So let's see what we find and let's see what we find here in Nelson Guys, welcome to the main street, the commercial area Oh my god, this place is beautiful So it's many so, people walking it's around It's so busy actually I did not expect this for, uh, for the South Islands I don't know if that's uh, just because it's Saturday and everybody's off But it's so busy, so many cars There's So many trees, it's so green around here yeah. And yeah Absolutely buzzing today on this fine Saturday afternoon, guys. Oh wow, this is cool. There's so many shops to choose from. So much shopping you can do possibly here. Wow. And this is beautiful. Wow. So guys, we're walking to the Nelson Market. That's on every Saturday morning till 1 p.m. Yeah, we're just making our way there now. So it's just around the corner there, guys. We drove past it looking for some parking, but we couldn't find any parking. It's actually quite hard today. I don't know why it's so busy, but there must be a reason behind it. It's actually everywhere paid parking here. Yeah, 60 minutes free as well. But parking is pretty free. cheap, it's only one dollar per oh, hour, yeah. so it's not too expensive. So you have all the commercial kind of shops I'm seeing here, pharmacy, everything mountain warehouse, what you usually have. Yes, my love. It's very noisy though. So it's very noisy. noisy. Why it's why all the cars, it's all that it's noise normal. pollution from the cars. That's pretty cool. Want to drink fluoride? They're doing petitions about fluoride in the water in Nelson, which is true. We don't like uh, fluoride in the water, and it's good the way they're trying to get it rid of it because not everywhere in New Zealand has fluoride in the water. Just some oh. some locations. Oh There's the market. Oh my god, that's the busiest market. It's so busy. Look at this. Look at this. How busy this is. Oh, Glen loves market stuff. They all like markets sometimes, depending on what they have on offer. So. We're going to explore and see what they have in the store for us in this lovely market on this lovely sunny day. Yes, some flowers. Oh, that's new. We have, I don't know, we have some pillows. It's a pillow with the wall. This is a homemade, this is a crafted pillow, homemade. Oh, that's beautiful. It's like Nelson. The Nelson flag? Yeah, Nelson. Or like this one, with Christ shoes. That is a pretty cool, cool pillow though. I bet they have that everywhere from like all the places. $50 each, man. Or two for 90. Everybody have a lot of creative people oh, here yeah, in the market. Strawberries. strawberries, you want strawberries or? I, don't want, I really do want strawberries. But they're big baskets of strawberries. Hi. How are you doing? You well? Do you have any it? seconds? Are they seconds there already? They're seconds already. They're $12. That's a lot of strawberries for $12. Yeah, let's get these. Yeah, but that's, no, that's sick. Can we get you want to grab them? Here's the dollar bills. Are they freshly picked today, yeah? Ah, uh, yesterday. Oh, nice. Very good. Is that common in Nelson? Strawberries? Um, Thank you. Yeah. 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 Okay. Appreciate that. Thank you. All right. See ya. You get a good bargain there, madam. I'd say it Twelve dollars. I mean, that's a big amount of strawberries for twelve quid. Honestly, I really love strawberries. Probably one of my favorite products. Oh, there you go. That is River Terrace nurseries selling a mixture of everything actually avocados free for ten dollars hazelnuts a bit of everything they look all very very organic very cute cool. the jade the green jade the famous shade of the south islands the murray people yeah you get that everywhere you can find it on the west well it's the the jade is found on the west coast in the south island or in the south island on the coast yeah you got that right madeline yeah. that's a true fact you have a bakery your favorite location for pastries and bread get some fresh bread i'm not sure if you want to check the bread out european bakery how are we doing you well all right european european standards yeah trying 
too, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this year I'm a bread medal, I think. I only do cash or internet banking though. That's okay, yeah. Are you you're European got, with that uh, yeah. cannabis there? Yeah. It's German bread, is it? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Rise from Germany as well. Very good, madam. I always buy it on the supermarket back home. It'd be nine dollars because we've got to cover for the cost of having the rye from Germany to here. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. yeah. Oh, a rye from Germany. Oh. oh wow, so it's very. Cheap. That's dedication. Yeah, when he's a master baker from Germany, yeah, he wants home away from home. Oh. Hello. Hey. I know. <laughs> Documenting our day today. Yeah. I'll, yeah. I'll try one. Yeah. Want to get it? So we got two purchases. Two minutes in the market. Actually, this is really true because he's actually from Germany, from where I'm from. So, so this is actually shipped from actually, Germany. No, like the right, like the the flour. Ah, he ships see. from Germany nice. and then he bakes it here. So it's gonna be, it's gonna so feel like this home. is like really feel like home. And it's nine dollars for this stuff. Glenn, you wouldn't let me otherwise buy a bread from my No, I just let you buy it because I wanted it make you feel like you were so at home a bit so guys, give it a home feeling if you ever go to germany you have to try bread we have so many nice bakeries so that's probably one of my favorite. they live on bread in germany sure and so that's why they have a nice selection of vegetables madam oh wow the prices actually are pretty good that's two dollars for this oh, wow. celery is three dollars two dollars for the carrots this is the place to go for vegetables yeah. nice. Mix oh, look at tomatoes. It's quite organic as well. The, it, it added tomatoes to 50. Look at them. They're not organic. No. No, they're not organic. No. no. You can tell. The organic. No, I know. There's an organic one that's further yeah. down here. Yeah. yeah. Just on the left. Just before the end. Yeah. One in. Oh, okay. There's an organic one. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for the heads up. Really Everybody's good. enjoying themselves. Yeah. I already am very happy with my purchases. I'm loving it so far. I need to get a coffee soon, yeah? Yeah, you should get a coffee. Selling everything here. Avocados, one dollar model. Wow. We have the vegan cuisine, we have waffles and smoothies, crepes, pancakes. This is a funky place. This is really It's a very vibrant place. Definitely, the, I feel like the people are very different here in Nelson. It's a bit more of a hipster vibe compared to the rest of New Zealand, or the rest of the South Island. This is pretty cool. It's awesome, isn't it? Pancakes, crepes. A bit of knitting going on here. It just keeps going back. It's pretty big. It is pretty big. It's very compact and big though. The whole Nelson community has come out to shine on this beautiful day. You have a nice crystal selection there for your metal. Your favorite thing to do is to check out the crystals. <laughs> oh, metal. Some lavender. You have a lavender. Some lovely band over there. Anything of interest, madam? Any soap? No, yeah. So it's, it's all it's all natural makeup. We buy yeah. we buy the bases and we add the, the lavender oil. Okay. okay. Yeah. We need some anyway. So you got some uh, lavender soap, yeah? Yeah, because Glenn lost our soap. So never. I never lost your soap. Oh, look at him. Loving the vibe of these guys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Over there. Must be a bit of an African community up here in Nelson. Pretty awesome. Pretty nice. See, that's giving me tropical vibes again. Yeah. By Nelson? Yeah. By the music? Yeah, yeah definitely. Nice <laughs> suit in the relaxing position too. Such a great vibe off them guys. They're playing the music back here with the instruments. So we're going to continue to walk through the markets and then we'll probably explore the outer part of the market so explore the city oh yeah what do you do that's mexican mexican food is it you don't want any do you we just had breakfast we just had breakfast <laughs> some hot pies mother pies pastries i think there's a lot of competition here with the vegetables there's a lot of vegetable stores are probably competing with the prices vegetables and fruits how beautiful how are we doing boss you well pretty good craft them yourself very creative. Good on, good on you. I don't have a house, but I have a car, <laughs> so I can't even uh, hang them up. <laughs> have a good day, yeah? Oh, some fine cheese, Maddo. The favorite part of the market, probably. You want to try it out? But yeah, that's a really nice presentation there we have. It smells, it smells beautiful. Hey guys, how, you how are you doing, boss? You well? Oh, good. good Loving the t-shirt. Huh? The Nelson tropical vibes. <laughs> I knew it was tropical in Nelson. <laughs> I have sheep milk this side, A2 cows milk this side. Any goats? Have you tried goat just down the road here? Ah, okay, okay. We only, yeah, we only do sheep and cow. 
There you go, madam. It's a camembert. Alright, give it a taste. It's not normally open, no, the camembert. No, no. Oh, it's not, no. <laughs> oh, okay. You get special attention. Oh, my God. <laughs> we'll try that and then try this. Yeah. Uh, but you're touring around, I take it, eh? Yeah, yeah. Seeing the whole country, yeah? It's a really lovely country. Yeah, it's so good. We enjoyed it it's so just, far. It's pretty unique, all right, yeah? yeah it yeah, is beautiful. Yeah. No, it's it's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Completely different vibe. It's a different vibe. Yeah. Yeah. It's very, fo very focused on the cheese. Yeah. Can you explain me, like, the, the rules with making the cheese with the pasteurized milk and you've seen it? Is there any restriction, anything? There is a restriction that we have to make all... It needs to be minimum 60 days old. So it's okay. been aged for at least 60 days yeah. before we can make it from raw milk. Wow. Uh, but, the, but then the restrictions on us for making it from raw milk is also twice what it is for making pasteurized. And you would have to be a pretty talented cheese taster to know the difference between raw and pasteurized. The biggest difference is that... So with milk, we get A2 milk goes straight to our factory from the farm. We pasteurize it, that is it. We don't standardize it, we don't stabilize it, we don't homogenize it, we don't do all we don't break it apart. And right, it okay. So that's probably the big difference. That's maybe the difference. Yeah. yeah. That's so why always, you... obviously we're from Europe and that's a, that's a try this that's I'm not a... I'm not really a cheese expert or oh, okay. that's a that's a sheep milk. Sheep milk. Oh yeah. You like it? Yeah. That's good isn't it? It's actually nice. Yeah it is. So that really can we taste? No, yeah, that's that's really good. Do you like? Do you want to get some cheese or? Like Beautiful yeah, selection there. Look, like big blocks of cheese, like massive. Like you. Where, wow. you, where are you from? Germany. Germany. And Ireland, yeah. And Ireland. Yeah. yeah. Look at that cheese, that's beautiful. So this is a Swiss, like an Alpine style. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, you're very good. Thanks very much. Mm. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. That is beautiful. That is good, yeah. That is good. I think you need to get some cheese. Oh, yeah. So cool looking, isn't it? <laughs> cheese it's tasting so experience here. Yeah. <laughs> We got some sheep milk, sheep milk camembert. Milk. Oh, you paid already? Okay. Yeah, paid already. So you got some $8. sheep cheese. Pretty good. Bargain. Thank you, sir. You are so Thank welcome, you. guys. Thank it's you a pleasure. Now. Thanks for the cheese experience. You're very welcome. <laughs> Don't matter, got the cheese. Got some nice cheese. The this sheep is, cheese. This is my objective. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this. She's this is in her element. Um, well, this is an interesting fact. It actually hasn't been raining in the past three months in Nelson, so and for us, that's this incredible. Is like a beautiful day here. That's mad. I didn't actually know that. The guy told us there three months without rain, and it's supposed to be raining tonight. What is the chances when we arrive? Let's hit the road. Let's explore town now along the streets. Love this market, I have to say. That was a good experience. So let's walk. Let's continue the adventure, the venture through town. I think we have sort of a mall here, and we're just going to explore. We're going to walk through here. And see where we end up actually because we don't know where we're going. Obviously it's a force of pressing so we don't exactly know what we're doing I but we are. I would like to have a coffee, would you? Yeah, I think it's that time of the day. I still haven't bought a coffee. I think I spend a lot of money on coffee guys. Yes you do. Every week. It all adds up. If I buy two coffees a day, buy, buy seven? Yeah. Oh, it's $140 a week. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you should cut back. Ben, I think you should cut back on coffee. Oh my god. When you really think about it, it's a lot. But money like, guys we don't drink alcohol so yeah it makes up it makes up for it oh we have a nice massage here 20 minutes 40 dollars for... nelson is the artistic city one of the oldest cities in the south island so we have a lot of flowers decoration around town what? definitely makes town look more Honestly, beautiful guys. vibrant colorful is this my new favorite city i could be it actually really could be your favorite city we have to make that opinion when we finish that trip around new zealand from one to ten our favorite places in new zealand we should make a list finished our cities i think we've seen all cities nearly nearly we're nearly there you can even hear crickets in the background there's a little uh field stall there a little van in the middle of the street so funky iconic keys posters books closing down sale we have the police over here doing their duties their patrol do you know what direction you go Mado? no Salad dosa, $12. Do you know where you're going? I'm getting lost right now. In a good way. Getting lost into this beautiful town of Nelson. Oh, we have uh, somebody playing the piano over here. In every New Zealand town, they, they like to have pianos in the, in the main streets. The funky design, though. Good job. Mado, you have a little uh, sitting area over here. You can sit in the net and relax. Oh, you can chill out on the net there if you want. Relax yourself, chicken. Yeah. And I have this beautiful view here, which is, what is this? I don't know. Oh, there's a big huge monument in the middle. Yeah. Is that the one you're talking about in the Botanical Gardens? No, not this one. Okay. This is beautiful. Guys, if you're exhausted after a heavy day of shopping, 
this is the right place to chill out and take a power nap. Wow, this is the good life, isn't it? Right here in Nelson, in town. Oh my God, this is definitely the Enjoying the piano here in the background, someone's this, playing. This is, a, this is a bonus point. It is, yeah. You wouldn't expect oh, this in a town. Oh, and you hear the crickets in the The crickets in the, in the trees. trees in a city. What the hell? I forgot the word for them. Oh, they're not crickets, they're called the step to S, sis. I don't know what they're called. Yeah. You guys uh, told us. You so. guys. It's very vibrant, very green. So all the trees obviously make the so town nice and cool. Guys, we're just here on the on, sun. So we're just here on Trafalgar Street. Four minute see? walk to the coffee and place. Just right behind us, we actually probably check out the tower there. And it's the Christchurch Cathedral. All so right. let's have a look let's there have a look. first. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Oh, you follow the lead, Meadow. Uh, yeah. If you can get up. Go, 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 get up. Get, out. get up, get up, get out of the seat. Enough relaxing time. I feel like this is the dining area of the evening time where everybody comes out for dinner. Because it's a well, well laid out area. Nice atmosphere, nice environment. Even a water fountain, you can drink water. Can you drink this water, my friend? Can you drink this water? No, oh, you can't. <laughs> I was gonna try to drink the water there out of the fountain. I don't know, there's a lot going on here on this Saturday, on the weekend. Oh, there's a lot of events going on. Now some male voice choir. Probably the choir from the, from the church guys. Sing some songs. It's beautiful. Look at this. Established in 1842. Go, go, go. Nice, it's no? Cathedral. It's Cathedral Nelson. Welcome. We're going up there? No. Really Get not. Get stairs. <laughs> Quickly. Wow, what a view, look at this. Yeah, it's cool. Oh, it's hot. Go. As it's soon as you come out of, the, out of the trees, man, it's really hot in Nelson. I mean, it's known for that, so. They're doing a marvelous job over here, making the atmosphere better in town. Some lovely voices. Right, Mato, what's the story? Where we go? Just kind of trying to walk around all the main areas to yeah, fully so explore it. Oh, sounds like a solid plan. Get me, get me buzzing again. <laughs> That's an absolute vintage of a car. That's a beauty. A Land Rover. I really want, I wonder what year that was. 1961. 1961 Land Rover. It looks like something from the military. That's the thing in New Zealand. They like to collect all the old vintage cars. And you see a lot of old cars in the streets, which I find so fascinating. So we're going to continue walking down the main street here, fully embrace this beautiful day. So we're continuing on to Bridge Street. What a great name for a, for a location. So obviously this, this commercial area is never ending, it just keeps going. I just didn't realize how big Nelson was, but there you go. You learn something new every day guys. Oh, back into the sunlight. Out, out of the shadow of the trees and we do have some lovely architecture around here so Mano just spotted the cafe right across the street we are in an old building renovated into a cafe it's beautiful it is the rock shop Mado. we have the rock shop i don't know what the rock shop is. i don't know what this rock shop is either it's like a rock like rock some rocks <laughs> and they actually have an outdoor garden where you can enjoy the coffee and with some uh, some food vendors japanese fried chicken we have a bit of everything actually. That is awesome. A little food court. That's cute. It is. It's a really nice cafe. Loving the loving the design actually. It blends in pretty well. Hello, how are you? Do you want anything? Can I just get a long black coffee please? Yeah, sure. Long black. Thank you. Yeah. That's everything, yeah? It's a pretty funky cafe. Oh, thank you. Don't worry. Here. Um, can I just get a name? Glenn. Can you guys actually stay? Walking around exploring town for the first time, so. Yeah. Where are you visiting from? Ireland and Germany. And we have a little food area where you can sit down and enjoy your coffee and food. Some Japanese fried chicken. Ozone coffee roast. A funky little cup. It's cute and small. Good job. I can't even drink, it's too hot. I have to wait. Maybe get some cold water inside. What's a choy latte like? Up to your standards, your expectations? Up to my standards. Oh, very nice. You like? It's actually really, really nice coffee. Oh, wow. Yeah, delicious. Bravo to you and your your research on Google. <laughs> F45, Jim. I mean, 4.8 on Google Maps. Top, I mean, even the design inside, the people are so nice. Really nice style. atmosphere. A little garden to sit inside. They were really nice. Really nice people. Night. They were beautiful human beings. Heart of gold. So, 
it all shows as soon as you walk in the door how good a coffee's gonna be. <laughs> I mean, it's always like the people in a yeah. place in a country always makes a big difference, especially New Zealand. And we have a great time here in New Zealand because everybody's so nice. Great hospitality, the whole package in one. No, everybody thinks we stink forever. Maybe we do, maybe we don't. <laughs> So we're walking down to Trafalgar Street. Are you saying that right? I'm pretty sure I'm saying Trafalgar Street right. That's an interesting name. It's I can't even pronounce it. Like I can't even pronounce it. You have that in, in Thank London. you, sir. In Thank London, you. They have Trafalgar Square kind of. Ah, right. Where do you go? You learn something new every day. I think that's the end of the. The main commercial area. Let's turn around and continue our adventure up this way. So guys, we just got back into the car. Guys, we're heading to the Queen's Garden. It's also from the CDC and it's just a 10 minute drive. But we have to go somewhere probably afterwards. So we just pick up the car now. If you can definitely walk from the city center, it's a 10, 11 minute walk to the Queen's Garden. And yeah, I don't know what to expect, how big it is. So we'll see. Let's do it. Let's do Enjoy it. That's the coffee shop where we just were. I'm just so amazed by these flower, by this green scenery. It's really they really, giving really me... have a good council, don't they? Oh, yeah. Looking after the beauty of this town. So from the bread and cheese we purchased from the market, Guys, Mara we... decided to make a little cheese sandwich, sheep yeah. uh, cheese, uh, it's with some real German bread. I have to say, it does smell like back home. Oh my god, it does. Yeah, I just have no knife to use a fork. Use a fork? Yeah. Right. That's our lunch now. Bit of cheese and bread. Yeah. High quality grade food here, guys. From the top. And a bit of strawberries Chef over here. Eat this. Oh, pretty good. Thank you. Try it. Mm. How is it? Marvelous. Is it actually good? Do you like it? Well, actually, I didn't get any cheese yet. Moving back to Germany. Do you actually just say that? No, or? I mean it. You want a strawberry, Glenn? Yeah, making the most of life here. Right, so we are entering the Queen's Garden. Oh wow, I didn't know they had And we have a Chinese, Chinese part of it. Oh wow, this is pretty cool. Didn't know that. No, we didn't, no. Mm. Mm. Look at this. What does it say? Free access. Free access, it's pretty great. The Italian gardens are all free, mm. the, the museums, it's wow. wonderful. It's wonderful to get to experience all these free activities while traveling throughout New Zealand. Nice. So how, how big is the park, Meadow? Not too big. It's a small one, is it? Small and sweet for a quick tour. I'm just listening to the creatures and the trees. It makes the experience so much more enjoyable. There's a lot of duckies in the river. Sad times from Meadow. All the roses are gone. Rose season is over. And we've enjoyed that we have enjoyed the rose season throughout New Zealand yeah. while traveling up the up the South Island. So ah, look, I think they have a restaurant over there on the waterfront facing the water. How big is this place, Meadow? It's not too big, no, it's just more of a place to relax and chill out and have a, a nice picnic. Which we're having right now. We're enjoying some cheese and bread and strawberries. <laughs> Guys, we're just going out to the waterfront now. We've yeah. just gone through a house in the state. So we're so. just driving around, really exploring. Yeah, the houses are really funky around here. Yeah. Beautiful. Look at the houses, Mabel. Funky. What we funky? I mean, it's just a different vibe to other towns. It is. Yeah. Nelson vibe. What's the Nelson vibe description? I, I don't know, it like feels very like kind of give me California vibes or it's Have just you been more to California? Huts and I've seen a lot of videos. Just, you know, That's why you always call it tropical. It's tropical, yeah. We in tropical. Very hot climate. Very hot climatized. Yeah. There's a stadium there in front. We have some lovely oh, yeah. penthouses. Well, On the left, some beautiful apartments. Apartments. What way, Madam? Um, right, Lynn. Right, under the highway we go. Just to the highway. And it's very flat it's compared to Wellington. Yeah, yeah. So it's basically the port. We're going down to the port down to the the port has to offer. Oh, look at all the boats in this water. That's so nice. Anyone that brings us out on a boat trip? Yeah, anybody there? Let's ask a boat. <laughs> or work on a boat or do something in return. Guys, if you have a boat in New Zealand, in Nelson, New Zealand, let us know. Really, mountains.
mountains, you have water. So we actually live like along the street just when you go outside yeah, of Nelson. And it just gave me such Eastburn Wellington vibes. I really feel like here in Nelson you get it all. You have like everything, like the water, the mountains, nice little town, everything. There's some really loving it. So guys we just got to the marina. Seems like a secret little location where everybody takes the boat out to the water over here. It's more like the location where everybody goes like swimming, diving, fishing or so. Yeah. So Wanna guys, catch a few fishies? I mean, it's not the nicest spot to park and to have a picnic, but this place is called Mai Tai River and Sea View Point. Yeah, it's not the most special place here in Nelson, but we'll probably find somewhere nicer now. We're gonna go on the hunt for somewhere, some nice seafront. You can go cycling here, you guys. You have to howl. Anybody's cycling here, though? Yes, you have to howl at shore. Howl at shore, okay. So Watch we, these bikes. So we're actually trying to go to. Tahunui Beach. Very good pronunciation. Beach. No, I don't know. Can I say that? <laughs> Tahunui Beach. Have a little rock in the middle. Look, special rock a meteor yeah. that fell out of space. Just planted here in the water. There is also a nice beach. beach. Can we drive over the beach? That's probably the one where we want to go. Oh yeah. That's pretty cool. Look at them. Everybody's driving a little old car here. Loads of old cars. There's so much going on in Tahunui. I feel like we're in a Holiday park or something. Yeah, it's paradise. Yeah, look at this. This is swimming pool. Or it's something. Mini golf as well. Water slides, mini golf. Just, this place is hopping over here. Yeah, look, some music, some tunes. Yeah. I bet everybody's enjoying a few alcoholic beverages. See, so. So we're just actually just driving around and driving to the end just to see. Look, it's called Nelson Fun Park. Hydro slide, bumper boats. Oh. It's perfect. Oh my god. Go kart. Yes, Go you want to try it, Madeline? I love go kart. Go -kart. I'm actually really good. Are you? I'm I really don't believe good. you. I am really good. I went last time in Ireland and I beat all my colleagues. No. What are you doing? I want to first. Oh, wait. do you actually want to go go karting? Yeah. Extreme sports. Madeline, what's the story? Are you enjoying the beach? It's nice. You like it? Yeah. Welcome to Nelson. Everybody's walking the doggies. There must be doggy paradise oh, over here. Maybe you can pet there must be the doggy beach. Loads of people here, people. But there's also a lot of parking possibility all along the beach. And Massive. Kind of fun park. And we could go kart them. We can't go kart them. Are we going? We need to check the price out. We should go go kart. It's pretty expensive though. Do you like? Would you like to do that? Yeah, it'd be fun, wouldn't it? Drift around the corners. So we have our own big go kart anyway. <laughs> But uh, the, look at all the little islands in the middle of the water. It's been an absolute fabulous day here in Nelson. We obviously didn't see everything, but we no. gave it a first impression. And we, we guys, we, guys, we definitely, we are really excited to make more videos here. We also want to make a video in the Apple Tasman yeah, region. Yeah, we'll come back. We will so, come back. And we also soon. will come back. We are hooked, like seriously, like it's amazing, amazing city, amazing vibe, amazing first impression, guys. Yeah. We have to come back for more. If you're from Nelson, let us know in the comments below. We always love to meet some people because we will video, be back. <laughs> yeah, this video might be uploaded by the time yeah. we get back. Uh, maybe we can meet up with you guys. Yeah. That'd be awesome. If you have a boat, love to come out on the boat with yeah. you. Because I know people love their boats here. So, so let us know. Send us an email. Send us a direct message on Instagram. Let us know. And we really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like, subscribe, comment down below. And we'll catch you in the next adventure. Have a good one, guys. Bye. Bye.